I'm Ethan Kwan, and today I'm going to be showing you um, my my trapdoor domino. Okay, um, I call it that because it's like a person walk um, was walking. He he stepped on a trapdoor. He fell down. So so um, this is how you make it. So first, you're gonna take a domino and have it the face towards you and this only I think this only works for like if you wanted to use this for like a plastic domino mine is probably special it's a wooden domino but um, yours is probably plastic so so this might work differently for you but um, I I'm gonna be showing you my way of doing it I don't know what to do for your way but you're gonna have to figure that out okay so what you do is you're gonna set up one domino with its face facing towards you now you're gonna take two more dominoes and then kind of like if you were looking at it from the top it would look like an eye like that but but what you're gonna do is separate it like it's like like you know this width right here this this length um, you're gonna put it right here and then do it half of that so like that same thing with this side okay now you're gonna take another domino and you're gonna place it on top of this domino that's gonna be the trap guy oh no I'm trapped <laughs> right um that's the guy who's gonna be like um, falling through the trap door. Well, it's not really a trap door, but anyway. Oh, by the way, this only works like about half the time. You're go you're gonna have to experiment with it. But now what you're gonna do is oh maybe this has to be a bit closer. So now what you're gonna do is put one domino like that in front, and one in the back like that. Okay, and try and like push them together as far as you can like this. Okay, there. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take two more dominoes. You can do it one by a t one at a time. It doesn't really matter. And try to make these two dominoes in the middle. So you can take an another domino and do that. And take another domino and do. Oops. Watch out for that though. I'm not that again. I I'm not that good at dominoes. Not the game, of course. Just playing with them. Well, technically, playing with them is doing this and playing, like, the game. Okay, anyway, um, once you have done that, um, it might help to look at it from an angle, and then this side, up from above. Okay, that's what it looks like, right? And this, this piece right here should be, so, as you can see, it should be right in the middle of this domino, and it should stick halfway up from that domino. Um, or almost halfway up, actually. Um, so the next step is to, and this is like for weight, if, um, if it doesn't work like this the first time, add, um, add or subtract one domino and see what works best for you. Um, I think it works best for me when I have four dominoes on top. So, um, let me... You can put them on um, all the time, but I like doing them slowly and steadily. Um, again, yours is different. So yours is most likely different, so so be careful with that. Um, once you do it the first time, it might collapse because it, like, like I have a lot of fails like that. Well, like one or two, but anyway. Um, so, so like this, like sometimes if you add one, it's gonna be too heavy, and then like when you when you try and trigger it, it's gonna like just collapse. If it's too light, it might it, it's too light. So, so when you do it, it's gonna again collapse. Um, so I think four works best for me, but um, you can test that out. I don't know. Maybe yours will work like that too. I haven't tested it out for other ones. I have tested it out all with three and five, and those didn't work for me. 
so um, you're gonna have to um, experiment with it um, so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna um, put a domino and now now here comes a pretty good measurement let me zoom in so so you know this distance right here these two um, that has to be half of this so like that same with this side like that there we go should be like that and on the other side as well see okay let me zoom out again now what you're gonna do is do it from behind as well well you don't have to you can just do this for fun I don't know how helpful this might be in like a real I don't think it's gonna be that helpful in like a real I don't know like a real domino but set but I I'm, I just think it's fun to watch now this might fail but mm, you're gonna excuse you're gonna have to excuse me if it does because I can't make it work like every time okay here we go three two one oh well it sort of worked okay okay um let's go to the slow-mo playback Three, two, one. Okay, so um, if you like that slow mo playback, um, I hope you did because it looks really cool, doesn't it? Right? Um, as you could, as you saw, like, like you saw the effect of like when when you did the dominoes, like it it basically um slowly went along that row and then like hit that last domino that went collapsing and then and then that domino fell but then but then it the toll tower collapsed which is um sort of a fail okay so i'll see you at how to do stuff with ethan.com and see you Next time. Bye. As you can see, see, you can see the word bye. Bye. As you can see. Hi, I'm Ethan Kwan. Oops. Cut. Oh. Wait. Nothing. Take down the perfect multi gin. Okay. Cut. Hi. That was too loud. Cut.